Hello children. Today in EVS 1 for standard 4, we are going to learn lesson number 14, maps and symbols. In our previous lesson, we learned about how to observe a map and read a map and plot the different districts. Today we shall learn about it more in detail using the different symbols. In our surroundings there are different things which are natural and few things which are made by man. So we shall see few things that are natural things. Now what are natural things? Natural things are the things that are obtained by nature. So here you can see in the picture the trees, the sky, the rivers, the sun, the mountains, the rocks, the grass. All these are natural things. We'll see few more examples like the coal, the animals, birds, the fuel that is petrol, diesel, etc. different animals and their young ones the sand and the different sea creatures and the human beings all these are natural things now we shall understand and know about the man made things things that are made by man are known as man made things for example wells houses water tower bridge cars factories school different kinds of vehicles different furniture and electronics clothes books buildings towers etc all these are made by man so they are the man made things man made objects are made from natural resources for example we make chairs tables cupboards bed etc all the different furniture from the wood obtained from trees so the trees are been cut down and these different furnitures are been made this picture shows the area around anju's house and school now we have to do this activity with the help of the picture find anju's house in the picture but before that first we have to mark the compass rose that is the four main directions so here is anju's house find her school in the picture yes this is anju's school find a route from anju's house to a school and color it Here is the starting point from Anju's house. We will go straight then take a left turn and then we will go straight till the end and reach Anju's school. On the way from Anju's house to the school we can see the banyan tree statue of shivaji maharaj anju's friends house hotel district hospital post office central market park etc so the route anju passes along is a narrow lane and a main road on her way to school there are several things on both sides of the lane as well as the road 
write the directions in which the places on the narrow lane are situated the statue of shivaji maharaj anju's friend's house hotel are situated in the west direction whereas the banyan tree and zilla parishad office is situated in the east direction write the directions in which the places on the main road are situated from the main road police colony bus stop police chowki district telephone exchange center are situated in the north direction while the hotel district hospital park are situated to the south direction mention the directions in which she must turn on the way to school on the way to school anju must turn in the west direction a smaller picture of anju's house and locality that is the area around anju's house that is the meaning of locality is given in this picture however realistic pictures of trees and buildings are not shown in it in their place certain symbols are drawn what these symbols represent is also mentioned against each of them note that some of the things seen in the locality have not been shown in this picture so you can see over here they have shown the tree the house the bus stop so different symbols are being used over here such a picture is called a sketch sketch and a map a smaller picture of a locality is called a sketch we made use of different symbols while making this sketch to convert a sketch into a map you need to show the directions and include an index a title and a scale moving objects are not included on a map for example people walking moving vehicles etc a winding road in an area is shown to take exactly the same turns on a map that is how roads rivers and railway lines are always shown on the map winding road means a road which has a lot of turns as you can see in the picture children do you know the art of map making has now advanced greatly our ancestors also used to make maps they used animal skins bones cowries and clay or stone tablets to make maps as you can see in the picture approximately 5000 years ago there was a civilization called mesopotamia a clay tablet was used by this civilization to draw or to make a map now we shall observe this map of maharashtra state 
read and plot few places on the map our state has a historic heritage maharashtra has forts near the sea in the mountains and on the plains now let us see few forts near the sea so the janjira sindhudurg etc are the forts near the sea the forts in the mountains raigad vishalgad etc are the forts in the mountains write the names of district with hot water springs so the district of thani and yavatmal etc have the hot water springs write the names of districts that have caves aurangabad latur etc are the districts that have the caves which districts of maharashtra have ports the districts like mumbai city mumbai suburban ratnagiri etc have ports i hope so you have understood the lesson and enjoyed watching the video thank you for watching please like share and subscribe my channel and stay tuned for the next video bye bye